Is this video really necessary for me to make? Let's find out. Hi, everybody. Welcome back to Hamshack TV. I'm your host, Josh AA4WX, right here on Hamshack TV. Thanks for tuning in. Guys, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button down below as well as the notification bell next to it. That way you stay up to date anytime I post a video or go live right here on Ham Shack TV. Before we get into it, don't forget about Ham Radio Prep. If you're looking to get your Ham Radio license, Ham Radio Prep is your number one source to do so. Go to hamradioprep.com, use coupon code HAMSHACKTV for an additional 10% off their already great prices on the technician, general, and extra class licenses. All right, let's get busy here. Uh, this notice uh, came down from uh, the FCC on November 4th. 2024. I cannot believe I'm making this video, but we're going to share it. <clears throat> this is a public notice, uh, enforcement advisory number 2024-03. Uh, it says, uh, reminder, amateur and personal radio service licensee, that would be GMRS, CB, uh, things of that uh, nature, but also amateur bands and operators may not use radio equipment to commit or facilitate criminal acts. The Enf uh, Enforcement Bureau of the Federal Communications Commission issues this adv uh, enforcement advisory to remind licensees in the amateur radio service, as well as licensees and operators in the personal radio services, that the commission prohibits the use of radios in those services to commit or facilitate criminal acts. The Bureau recognizes that these uh, services can be used for a wide range of permitted and socially beneficial purposes, including emergency communications uh, and speech that is protected under the First Amendment of the United States Constitution. Uh, amateur and personal radio services, however, may not be used commit to commit or facilitate crimes. The Bureau reminds amateur licensees that they are prohibited from transmitting communication, quote, communications intended to facilitate a criminal act, end quote, or, quote, messages encoded for uh, the purpose of obscuring their meaning, end quote. Likewise, the individuals operating radios and personal radio services, a category in, that includes citizens band radios, CB, FRS, walkie-talkies, uh, and general mobile radio service, G GMRS, are prohibited from using those radios, quote, in connection with any activity which is against federal, state, or local laws, end quote. Individuals using radios in, in the amateur or personal radio services in this manner may be subject to severe penalties, including significant fines, seizure of equip offending equipment, and in some cases, criminal prosecution. File a complaint. Here's the thing to do so. So let's talk about this. Why are we doing this? What has something happened uh, that has caused this notification uh, to need to be sent out by the FCC? I don't know, but guys, we all know better. We know better. Well, I can say that with the exception of FRS and CB. I'll get into that in a minute. But if you pay to have a license, you're expected to know the law for sure. And we know better. We can't do criminal activities over amateur radio. First off, you have no privacy there. Now, the article did talk about uh, encryption, and in ham radio, encryption is not allowed whatsoever, and I don't believe it's allowed in GMRS either. Um, however, um, apparently it's being done. You cannot encrypt your ham radio or your GMRS communication. Specifically, you also cannot do that for CB or FRS. And the reason I, s I separate CB and FRS is because you don't have to have a license for those. Uh, FRS, if you're not familiar, you know, you go to Walmart and you have, uh, cheap walkie talkies, uh, that you can find in the, uh, the sporting goods section or even children's walkie talkies that you find in the toys department. 
those are all operated on the FRS bands. Uh, CB, you can go to any truck stop, pick up a CB and get on the air right now, easily. Or you can get them off of Amazon. Don't forget about the Amazon uh, Ham Shack store, amazon.com slash shop slash Ham Shack TV. But anyway, you can get uh, you can get a, a CB uh, radio just about anywhere pretty easily. Um, those people are not necessarily aware of the laws. And yes, you cannot use a CB radio or an FRS radio to commit a crime. I don't know who would be stupid enough to do that anyway. Because frankly, if you're using an FRS, a CB radio, an amateur radio, or GMRS radio, do you think you have privacy? No. Anybody can hear it unless you're encrypting it. And you're not allowed to encrypt it anyway. But if you're breaking the law, so why do you care about encrypting your communication? I mean, guys, just be real. Do the right thing. If you commit a crime, use a cell phone. Don't use radio. You're, you're not hiding very well. So anyway, hate that I had to make this video. Uh, but it was so dumb when I was reading the enforcement bulletins. Mike, I can't pass this up. I've got to share it. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below if you already do. Ham Shack TV is going places this year and doing things. Those things are not cheap, free, or easy. So uh, if you uh, feel so inclined, uh, think about becoming a channel member uh, down below. You click the join button next to the subscribe button. Uh, it's, it's quick and easy. Uh, or if you just want to throw a tip in the chip tip jar, there is a super thanks button down below as well that you're happy to do uh, that, that you can do that. Other ways to support anything you purchase off the Ham Shack TV store goes towards the channel as well as uh, Ham Radio Prep. If you purchase Ham Radio Prep and use my coupon code, uh, we will get uh, some help from Ham Radio Prep. Don't uh, keep in mind we got Dayton coming up, we got the RARS Fest, we've got uh, Dalton, and we've got Huntsville. All those things aren't uh, cheap or free, so um, help us out if you can. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, and we'll see you on the next one. 73s, this is AA4WX, WSCB 693.